Archaeologists are digging around a nearly 100-year-old bend home looking for historic items. Noah Chast went to the dig site and joins us now with more. Noah? Lee, they're searching for any human-made items like pieces of a glass bottle or maybe a piece of some fine china. But the reason they're even digging around this historic homestead is because part of the property will soon become part of Highway 97. Anticipating finding a lot of historic refuse, like broken bottles, maybe some ceramics. Archaeologists with the University of Oregon are combing through dirt in Northeast Bend looking for historical items. We are really just here to see what's, what's still around. Their dig site is at the Nels and Lillian Anderson house off Nels Anderson Road near Highway 97. The house, built in 1929, was owned by Danish immigrant Nels Anderson who owned one of the first and biggest dairies in Bend. So he brought a lot of knowledge with him and finally settled on dairying here in the Bend region. The house is a local landmark and eligible for the National Registry. However, as part of ODOT's Bend North Corridor project, part of Highway 97 will go through the property, currently used by Instant Landscaping Company. ODOT is working with archaeologist Brian Lane and his team to make sure the area is thoroughly searched before any construction begins. It's a historic dump site, so we could find a lot of different materials uh, in here. We're just not sure what to expect at this point. Layer by layer, his team is digging through the land looking for something good. So what we're doing is we're sifting everything that was dug up in the other sections to try and find something that was man or human made as opposed to just rocks and rubble. And tell me, what do we see? Well, for one, looks like we have a piece of ceramic there. That's what you would collect. Okay. The items will be brought back to the U of O lab, analyzed, and ideally pieced back together. However, it's unclear if the house itself will make it through. Everyone's goal is to preserve this house. So what that exactly looks like is what we're still all working on figuring out right now. For now, Lane and his team will find and save what they can. Data recovery through excavation is kind of the, the last resource that we have at hand to record as much of the site as we can. The U of O team will be out digging for the next few weeks. Highway construction is planned for next spring with a decision about the house coming in the next few months. Lee? Tonight we're asking if you think your town does enough to preserve its history. To weigh in, head over to our web poll on the KTVZ.com homepage.